connected. With Unravel, you met Yarni, a tiny little character with a huge heart going on an epic adventure. You also met Martin Salin, a passionate and creative game maker from the Cold War studio that brought Yarni to life. We knew Unravel would steal your hearts because it stole ours. But it also showed us something profound. When we first saw Unravel, we saw a game that we knew deserved the world's attention. It deserved to be played. We also know that there are more out there, more studios like Coldwood, more games like Unravel. Passionate developers telling amazing stories, creating spectacular games. We are committed to working with small developers, finding these great new games, and giving all of you a chance to discover their magic. So today, we are very excited to announce EA Originals. Our EA Originals program is about three things. Firstly, it's about taking first-time experiences that are unique, gorgeous, innovative and memorable, and bringing them to the world. Secondly, it's about supporting small developers and help, helping them make the most of their games. Now, we'll seek out a few projects each year for EA Originals and partner with them through the whole process from development to marketing to publishing. And lastly, it's about funding and offering a level of security. Now, making games is hard. It's a hard business. And these small developers have risked themselves to develop a new IP and created games deserved, and great games deserve to be played. Now, check this out. With EA Originals, we want all the profit from these games to go back into the hands of the developers so they can keep innovating and creating into the future. Now, we've already begun with EA Originals, so please welcome to our stage Klaus Lüngeled from Zoink Games in Gothenburg. He is here to take you into the beautiful world of our first EA Originals game called Fear. Hi, everyone. Wow, it's amazing to be here. Joining you all at EA Play here in Los Angeles. It's, uh, well, it's really huge for me, and I'm super excited to be here. I run a small game studio in Sweden, in Gothenburg, called Soink, and we are about 20 people brought together by our fascination for new approaches to interactive storytelling and art. And recently, we've been on a journey with a very special new project. And thanks to Patrick and EA, we're here today to bring you along with us. Let me introduce you to the world of Fee. At its heart, Fee is a personal narrative about our relationship with nature. It's a game without words, a celebration of our longing to be one with the world around us. It's a story that reminds us that everything in this world is connected, living in a delicate balance that is constantly under threat. You awaken as a young cub, all alone in a dark forest glade, and you have no idea who you are or how you got there. But as you spy from the treetops, you'll soon come to know the extraordinary creatures that live in this forest. And you'll find that they are all connected through their own language, a language of strange and beautiful music. See, every animal, every breathing creature, and even the plants, they all have their own unique song. And by learning them, you can connect to the forest, to understand it, to be part of it. Each song you learn will help you reach new parts of the forest and take you ever closer to discovering the secret of your own kind. But you are not the only newcomer to the forest. The silent ones corrupt the forest and spread their silence with each step. As you evade them using stealth and cunning, you will uncover their terrible purpose. This is a game full of discovery, conflict, and relationships. But as you explore the world of Fae, we're not going to hold your hand. The game won't tell you where to go, what to do, or how to think. We will set the stage and invite you into the forest for your own personal experience. An experience that will leave you scared, amazed, and delighted. In the forest, your discoveries will be your own. I'm very proud to now show you more about the beautiful world of Fee. Thank you. <laughs> 